What's up guys? Welcome back to Brent Eats Eat with me, Brent Underwood. Today we're trying Prez Hells from Inferno Candy Company. Um, I'm not even going to say it, just... Um, so, uh, this is... Uh, you're going to pay $10 for a bag of these. First of all, let me tell you what it is before I get into all that. So, this is... Reaper chocolate covered pretzels and all I'm going to just show you all the pictures uh, Less than 1 million Scoville heat units. This is a snackable to medium heat Pictures of them there. It looks like they have some white chocolate ones as well as you can see And then uh pretzels reapers i don't know what that is a bowl of liquid <laughs> don't know what that is either some kind of i have no idea but um so here is what the package looks like if you buy the big bag uh if you do buy the big bag uh it's going to run you ten dollars and you can probably add about five six seven dollars to that for shipping um our Reaper chocolate covered pretzels start with a crunchy salted mini non-GMO pretzel then coated with our homemade creamy Reaper chocolate. Come on. The result is the perfect combination of the salt and sweet with a lot of heat. Our chocolate covered pretzels are made to order. Available in milk, dark, and white chocolate. I need those white chocolate ones in my life. <laughs> Each bag of chocolate covered pretzels is packaged in five ounce weights. Packaged in five ounce weights. Each bag is heat sealed for freshness. Why settle for the ordinary when you can have extraordinary? This item is mid hot. Um, yeah, uh, again, I'll show you the Scoville heat units. Uh, snackable to medium heat, less than 1 million Scoville heat units. Alright, let's get started. You're watching Burn Eats Heat. If you are not subscribed to Burn Eats Heat, there's no charge whatsoever to hit that subscribe button. Uh, and I would really appreciate your subscription. Uh, if you like today's video... Please show me by taking a second out of your day and hitting that like button. It's also completely free. All right, guys. So it looks like we got three chocolate covered pretzels in here. And you are watching Burn Eats Heat. And this is a snackable package. Um, so I will be eating all three of these. Hope you've seen them because I'm not showing you again. Thank you very much. Really good. <clears throat> it's like a homemade chocolate. Not like a store-bought chocolate. You can tell whoever made this chocolate made it with love. Pretzel number two. I want to point out something and I'm going to repost the description right here. <clears throat> and if I can, when I go back and edit it, I'll like highlight this part <clears throat> of the description I just read a minute ago. 
The result is a perfect combination of salty and sweet with a lot of heat. That sentence right there describes these pretzels perfectly. You get the saltiness of the pretzel, the sweetness from the chocolate. That's unlike any chocolate. You're you're not going to be able to go, like this. Isn't Hershey's chocolate? This isn't Reese's chocolate. This is Inferno Candy Company chocolate. Like you can tell it's homemade. <clears throat> and in no way does that mean that this isn't good. In fact, just the opposite. Very good chocolate. Um, and if you notice, guys, the chocolate is intact. If you remember, I did the white chocolate cherry bombs right after I got this uh, sample box from Inferno Candy Company. The white chocolate had melted and was pretty much a liquid when I did the white chocolate cherry bombs. And so I went through and picked out all the other chocolate items. There was two more. Uh, these and one other thing that is in my refrigerator. So all the chocolate items that was left over in the uh, sample packet, sample box, um, has been sitting in my refrigerator. So that's why you're seeing this chocolate intact right now. That chocolate is so good, it makes you want to do a little dance. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, it takes you to your happy place. I'm going to post a couple more pictures. I'm going to post a picture of the big bag here, and then I'm going to take a, a picture of this, the the artwork on this pit, uh, package, and post it here, just so you see the difference in the two packages. One has like a skull wearing a gas mask type deal, and the other is just Reapers with chocolate covered pretzels um, on the package. This is probably my top three. Mm, it's definitely in the top five of my best Inferno Candy Company products I've tried so far. The Press Hells is definitely in the top five. Probably the top four to be exact. Um, but yeah, guys. Uh, that's all I got. If you've made it this far in the video, I really appreciate it. If you could just take a second and hit that like button. If you're not subscribed to the channel, I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I love each and every one of you.